Hey, what's going on? It's Bill Burr. What's going on? Huh? Ah! Um, it's, uh, what the fuck is it? It's, um, it's time for the Thursday afternoon, just before Friday, Monday morning podcast, and I, I'm just checking in on you. <clears throat> I'm just checking in on you, just seeing how your week's going. Huh? Is it going the way you planned it? Did you have any plans? Think about that. That's like some self-help shit. Think about that, people. Like, when you start your work week, do, do you have a plan? I mean, other than getting in your car, kissing your wife or, 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 or a husband or, 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 or a partner or, 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 and you drive down the street and, 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 and you get yourself a coffee and you go into work. But, but do you have a plan beyond just taking the vessel that holds your soul into that workplace? Do you have a plan? Because I'll tell you right now, God has a plan. God has a plan for you and you and you and each and every one of you. But you have to listen. How can we know what our plan is? What his plan is for us? If we don't listen. (laughs) That right there is why I don't go to church. The, 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 the use of, of vocal dynamics. They always get way up. Then they come in for the whisper. Right? That's how it works. That's called the Sandusky. <laughs> I'm sorry, everyone from Penn State. I know your team's ranked. I know you're thinking you're going to fucking somehow slip and slide your way out of the horrors of that shower. And that no asshole sports fan like me is going to bring it up. Oh, no. It's going to be brought up. Jesus Christ. I'm going to take all the shit I took for some fucking air pressure. You know? You think you're going to take down one goddamn statue? We all know you're going to put it back up one of these days. We all know Joey Paz coming back up. Where are you going to put it, huh? Where are you going to put it? Probably in the booster's room, right? <coughs> when they bring all the money in. They're all sitting there going, it's okay, Joe. You didn't know it. We all know you never took a shower in fucking 60 years. Why am I, why am I doing this? I, you know what? I don't know why, because I got a bunch of shit to do today. And that's the first thing that came to my head. You know why? Because God, God has a plan for me. He has a plan for me to go on this podcast each and every Thursday and just check in on your week. That's my mission. I did the half hour cardio this morning. Do it with me. Here you go, everybody. I'm doing a half hour cardio every day. Every fucking day, I'm getting on that fucking elliptical, and I'm going to try to lose two pounds a week, drop eight pounds, get my fucking fat freckled ass down to about a buck seventy-five, sliding into the fucking new year. You know why? Because God, God wants you to be skinny. He doesn't want you. One of the seven deadly sins is that spaghetti old fat eating motherfucker laying face down in his bowl of shit from that movie Seven. And I've been kind of keeping my eye on the Celtics. I know we got Sacramento next. Um, But uh, you know what's so fucking dumb? Was that complete non-story of our center, Al Horford, getting criticized for for missing, uh, I think he missed the Miami Heat game. Because he he was with his wife because she was giving birth to his daughter. Oh, Jesus, who has the fucking nerve? To call me during my podcast. Don't you know God has a plan? Who is it? People, when you walk away from your recorder, always make sure you take off your headphones. Because if you don't, you're going to yank that fucker right across the room, and then you're going to have all that silence that you just heard, unless I took the time to edit it out, which I probably will. I'll probably do you a solid. And I know what a lot of you millennials are probably saying. Actually, I don't know what you're saying. You know, you're probably too busy having a fucking uh, doing the mannequin challenge or something else really important. Um, why talk down to the youth, Bill? Why would you do that? Huh? Is it because you're, you're every day creeping towards death? Um, <clears throat> uh, I know what you, you fucking technological douchebags are probably thinking. Why don't you just get some wireless headphones? You know why? Because I think I got enough satellites pointed at my fucking head. How about that? 
I got enough signals going in there. I can't remember shit. I've had this cough for two weeks. So you know what I'm blaming? Wireless headphones. Nia, do you think God has a plan for you? Because I'm here to tell you wow. that he does. <laughs> I feel like in Every another morning, lifetime, you could have been one of those TV evangelists. I could literally do it as a joke and just to see how far I'd get. And in the end, yeah. I gave everybody their money back, but then they'd be mad at me. Yeah. I'm just fucking with you. I don't know if you're going to go to hell or not. Here's your money back. <laughs> I'm just joshing you. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Remember when Jesus died and then he came back? Ah, I'm just fucking with you. That's what I was doing. <laughs> 